the, the reality of it is, is that this man is arrogant, Abu Muhammad Maghribi, and he believes in his twisted little mind that his way is the right way. Now, I took issue with Abu Muhammad Maghribi, right? Yes. Prior to him warning against me, I did take issue with him. Why? I took issue with him because I found that he was extremely harsh to the Salafis while at the same time having sobrum tawil with the people of innovation. That rubbed me the wrong way. That was one point. Why well, I kept saying, why are you in your mind, this is wisdom, utilizing all of this wisdom with the innovator, but your brother that's Salafi, that yes, is a little rough around the edges, that comes from the from 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 the from the from the streets. They come from the projects in the inner cities of America. They grew up hard. So they get it hard around the edges because they're hard around the edges. Be patient with those brothers, work with them, be easy with them, have forbearance with them, and you know, direct them to what is good. You don't want to do that. You X them off, you're not going to deal with them, and you warn against them in private. But then at the same time, you're going to all of these massages that the people are not selling you. Straight hisby. That with them within itself is not necessarily the issue. With them within itself, going to them to teach them, it's not necessarily the issue. As long as there's no strings attached, and, you know, no fear, so on and so forth to the end of it, you can go to them and you can teach them, no problem. But that wasn't the issue I took. The issue I took is not only are you going over there and having all this quote unquote wisdom, using all this wisdom with them and being easy with them, just because they're allowing you to come now, you're walking, you're, you're coming back and labeling that master the Selfie master. What in the world? They sell it you because they let you give classes there? Wh who are you, Yanni? Man, aunt. Who, what do you think about yourself? That because they let you come, now they sell it you. Because now the people in the area who trust you believe that's a sell it you masjid. And we know, we know from experience how some of these massage go. They may let you come and teach. And then sometimes, oftentimes, what happens? They'll tell you, thank you but your services are no longer needed. You go about your way now. And then they continue on with, with whatever it is they want to do. That's contrary mm -hmm. to the doubt. So now you're going to bring all these people over here, making them believe in selling a message. And now, so when the day come, they kick you out, what the brother's now going to stay? Some are going to stay because you said it's a selling a message. And now they're bringing in people. You understand? And he was defending a message that the, 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 the mudir from it was a registered, I mean, what'd you say? He was like one of the official uh, spokesmen for ICNA. You know, or, or it's not one of them too, right? And and, and, and the like, and, but they okay, but then the celebrities you're being harsh with, yeah, I took issue with that. So I, I would, I would, I wouldn't mention his name, but I would talk about that issue, how you have to have patience with the people who are Salafi. And if you're going to interact with the people, yeah, the, uh, of, uh, uh, of innovation, it's not going to be like this, not like that. And then you're harsh with the Salafis. I could, I could, I couldn't accept that.